So Ivan tried to convince me to move down here for years and I always said I would never live in Southern California because I just love Northern California. So finally I gave in and said, okay, we can let's move to San Diego. Let's try it. So here we are. We moved down we moved down here. Um, but after the first like year and a half I feel like I really settled in and don't miss San Francisco as much and uh, I found like our community here and especially now that we've started the business I definitely feel like more part of San Diego and that we definitely made the right decision. So when we moved down here we knew that we were gonna have some sort of food business because we both worked in the restaurant industry for so long but we didn't know exactly what we wanted to do so we threw around a bunch of ideas and then saw one of these vintage trailers and realized that that would be the perfect outlet for an ice cream for an ice cream shop in San Diego because San Diego there are so many little communities within San Diego that we could take it to each community well the whole concept of Calexico Creamery um, which we get a lot of questions about the name because there's a town called Calexico so they think that we're affiliated but the reason why we picked that was because we're making Mexican inspired recipes but in California with California products for the most part. The combination of the influence that Tijuana has on San Diego as well as San Diego with Tijuana produces like really neat things and I feel like this is like a good example of it like Calexico Creamery. Whenever we see something that like we think is a good combination that it might not necessarily be in dessert it can be like in food or savory dishes we try it out and if it doesn't work out it doesn't work out but we made the toasted coconut lately tres leches which is a very classic Mexican dessert uh, and then of course we, we make the classics, but we always maybe try to like give it a little twist. Like vanilla is made with real Mexican vanilla bean. We, will, we go and get it from the market in Tijuana. Um, mole comes from Puebla. The chalca comes from Oaxaca. But then when we end up getting like produce, we usually get it from like Susie's farm or in the same market. 